morning. Good morning, viewers, and welcome to another edition of the program Salon Morning Discoveries with me, Aisatu Smai CC. And today inside the program, we get the public relations manager from the Sarai Lee Road Safety Authority as Idenaya. So this morning, they can tell we plenty thing about the Sarai Lee Road Safety Authority and also they tell we about the biometric license where they launched this BNTM. Good morning and welcome to the program. Good morning, thank you very much. Okay, I go want to make you viewers go want for know much about the the PRO for the Sierra Leone Safety Authority. I go want to make you tell me more about you. Well, me na Abdul Karim Dumbuya, as you don't rightly say, PR manager for the Sierra Leone Road Safety Authority. I have done the day for almost ten years now. I've been working at University of Sierra Leone. My Republic Relations Office before I go in 2012. Okay, and this being term, we see the Sierra Leone Road Safety Authority be get uh, launching inside the launch the biometric license. Viewers go want for make for know within um, this biometric license they about. Well, the biometric license, as you don't correct it, not a license we they bring sanity to drivers to the transport sector because the issuance of the driver's license over the years, people don't they complain, police they express concern that uh, they, they see fake driver's license, then case that they boku boku they didn't have police. So then direct say, the advice say, for review the security features of the driver's license so that it will be difficult for fake and it will get robust security features. So we sit down, they set up a committee and uh, we come out with additional features with a card way different from the current card. And then features then they one, you get for capture you thumb you thumb print. Two, you get for capture you height, you weight, a lot of other features then, you blood group. So then they now that make we say biometric because it is just at the moment the license will the issue with the past license. Just they say you name, place of birth, date of birth. But now, it, and that thumb print the, uh, now one person no more they get in one thumb. Two people only get the same thumb. So now one key feature then of the driver's license. So when you talk about the this biometric license, you make measure of the blood sample, the blood group, and the weight. So why would I decide for put this inside this biometric license? Now, if license. Somebody get accident, maybe it they bleed, then we say for put for gear and blood. That in if we don't know through in lies in the blood group. So that means that they very very key. In case of hospital, then give what you lies in and you know which blood group will you fall. So that means that they very very important. So you talk about say this um, previous license like the past license won't be the issue out to drivers them and the fake one be the how comes driver go get fake license? Well, this IT business, a lot of people, then they imitate what the company they do. So if you make IT product too basic, for imitate them, it's very, very easy. So now that make, we don't come out now with very, very robust security features. We, if you say this is your license, we get a device we they use for check. And as them point your name, everything they come up, we go know if you get them or not, you get them. So now make that very, very important. Now technology-based license now, robo with robust security features. So I found I don't go for sensitize the drivers them concerning this license. Then they will not go all over the country. Every district, we get 21 radio programs a week for talk to drivers. We don't go to the lorry parks through the drivers union for talk to them. We don't go to schools, we don't go to colleges for talk to people. We don't go to marketplaces, other public places, and also we they talk to them through television, social media, so then in a channel, even the mosque and church, they would go there for go talk to them. So when we get to foresee this biometric license effective? The biometric license don't take effect. If you follow the news, we don't go present them to president, vice president, first lady, the inspector general of police, and the issuance they continue. The only thing, the, me the measures they now we day, you never forget NCRA certificate before you go to we. Because now, 
NIN, that national identification number, we need them for capture and for the license. So if you don't get them, we're not going to be able to issue the license. So then features and all the additional features for the new driver's license. So now I go, I go want, viewers go want for know like where you they talk about the slicing though and I don't present them to all the side of someone for who with them to the president to the IJ and all that thing. So like what about the one then now like the drivers and I'm we already get this um, normal license. So where the, where then the, the, the license gets for expire, they need for pay excess money for take this biometric license. No, when your license expire, you go with the license will not expire. You need pay the prescribed fee for the new license or the new one. That one day, you know they go through a long process. But all first timers, when they go for license, then get for go through driving school, then get for go through NCRA or country. But if you get evidence, if you don't get license, when you expire, you can't do with that one day. So what's in at the cost? Well, the license is by category. The category of the license then determine the cost. For example, the license when I just be, if you want B license for drive car, Jeep, you ride bike, now four hundred and twenty thousand Leons. If na A B license, A B license for bike and car. You they pay five hundred and twenty thousand. That's what the price called for. Okay, so now when you they talk about this biometric license, yeah, so I go want uh, viewers go want for no like um, most of the time we can see plenty um, youth them they way if they say they can go they can and they force as apprentice from there they learn how for drive and then from there now you go see the the begin for drive and then want for go for this uh, um, license. So if they don't get that NCRA, but they get them the voter ID card, or neither they get the, the, the other documents them, we will show say yes, then as Sierra Leoneans them, on a key issue out this ID, this uh, license to them. You forget NCRA certificate. We want license, you go NCRA, and they print a certificate you. We get all your information. Now it goes to we. Now with the process. Okay, so like when I get any training, when I can get to beginners them. Drivers. Yes, drivers beginners. Them. Beginners now they go through driving school. When they don't get driving school certificate, then come to we. I test someone who they test them. So because um, I go want for no like um, neither viewers go want for no if you like when I get any book where a B C on a key issue out to them for show them like the road signs which you're waiting and get for do before then when you they apply for drive for the first time now you go through driving school we get what you call frequently asked questions that book they day within they give them for go study they will also the manual for new drivers that manual they not only they take through the new drivers the new applicants because they get for city exam now I go want for no if not compulsory for lay person go through driving school before he able forget a driving license as a beginner. As long as na new as a beginner, you go for driver's license for the first time before go through driving school. So what about the youth man then now? Because um, I also get um, interest on their youth man them because you can find out the majority of them can be apprentice first before they decide for the driver because through the apprenticeship they get for the learner for drive push motor car and all that thing. So what about the apprentice then they and viewers will want for know if you then serve the part of that um who's the when a policy that all first timers once you want it gets licensed for the first time if you go through driving school. Whatever category you fall, if you go through driving school. So um, now, now on a decide for and for some or on a TV on a don't be. It is going in line with the new policy, the new driver's license. Now policy we come in, we put an we align now with the new driving license we come we they come. So what about the one in our noble school? Because as you say, the need for once and first time you they come for license, they go through driving school. That's a policy. So when they go through the driving school, what about the one in our noble school now? Because they get for take exam. 
once he came for license for the first time, he go through driving school. We get the certificate, he can't do it. Simple. If you don't get time, you don't get the license. Now policy, we you make provision for everybody. So we go driving school. Driving school, they set the standards for you based on the category we fall. If you're not illiterate, but you go through driving school before you get license. So this particular policy is yeah, so before owner gets for doing it, you know, we um, call on the driver's union president for making himself aware of this policy. I said there is a new policy in the way and they develop. We only really involve the stakeholders. The stakeholders, the police, the driver's union, the bike riders, the car riders, even the civil society. So they like, develop them policy there. So they are well informed on the new process for acquired driver's license. Okay, so now since you don't talk about the biometric um, license where SLRSC they give out to drivers them, and now we are going to make we draw your attention to other things and we don't they happen at the SLRSA and one are these some of them on our patients there so we, we can see the road safety cops they can do and most of the time we can see the motor car can park and also we see they can tow motor car for put inside so I want to make you tell me what in the operation and they can they have out well in a part of who mandate road safety then we tow motor car because you park on the wrong side and go to motor car because you know it ain't conflict with the road traffic act or regulation. If you park your vehicle on the wrong side, then go to them or then clamp them, then give you ticket. If you drive and not get license, if you vehicle no license, then ensure if you contravent any of the provisions in the road traffic act or, or regulation, then you will be to them and get them going to the impound yard. And if they get them going to the impound yard, the train fee you get for pay. And if you don't go for go reclaim your vehicle within a period of six months, we will fall the list of all vehicles in our possession for the past six months to the Attorney General's office. And the Attorney General, they apply in a court for them vehicle and for forfeiture. If the court give order, they forfeit them to the state. All the owners and they forfeit them to the state. Now they nominate a license option for sale and through public auction. And it was supposed to be other than Okay, as you got plenty in there for cancel way about SLRSA, since we don't talk about the biometric license, and we we'll get plenty in there more way you get for cancel way about the road safety authority. And now, um, before we go for short break, I just want to um, remind viewers them about the launching of Sarah Tong Season 2, where they come up on January 15, 2022. And not forgetting that the new city hall, Freetown City Council building, and also so the um, silver now uh, hundred and fifty thousand, the gold now two hundred and fifty thousand, and also the diamond now three hundred and fifty thousand. No miss this particular launching because, as you said, no see the Seraton volume. The Seraton season one gets enough and enough stories for now, and also the Seraton then season two self gets more thing than we on self gets for enjoy but that particular movie day. And not forget also say the program where you listen to and the program where you they watch now Salon Morning Discoveries and we they go for short break and where we come you get for kind of plenty in them about the Sarah Road Safety Authority because we get the public relation manager Wena Abdul Karim Dumbuya as it is inside the studio which we for telling more and more about the operation of Sarah Road Safety Authority. Tell everybody say the Diba de Rome agree say we for put bondo na Sierra Town this year. Alive to the people from This tradition be don't make form with grandpa, 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 them. When 
a pull bondo. No shaga song. They all pad them. Then they can pick pick all what she wants first. Now this time they say trade. This time they against that girl. You could make. Then you you let me see to your point. Now we don't turn this for those who have choose the woman them who let us a first marriage. And this lawyer will meet her. Who walk what I did and what I did back. You expect me for change the laws eh? Now this time, what will papa, then papa then? Don't make, now we the can't pull her. Then only don't die. Why that not the for China plan? Ah, Salomon. Eh, eh. Don't go to the end of the day. Come on, I'm from Basic and Tutu. I'm with you, too. Max, you know. I know what you can do, she feels. I don't care if you're fine. Is this you saying you? This tradition won't get to us yet. I'm not going to see you. I'm going to change up. Seniors, that this trip will decide for put bundu na share at all. No problem, go marry you. Over me, over me, little body, a grace in between me. I no wonder, sir. One, go, 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 the point. Susu, but Susu in business, do your mama want to wasi, wasi yani. Viewers, the program Salon Money Discoveries, they continue. And as we know, say we get the public relations manager, Wena Abdul Karim Dumbuya from the Sierra Leone Road Safety Authority, as editor, we plenty to you about the Sierra Leone Road Safety Authorities. Now, um, Mr. Dumbuya, since you only talk about the biometric license we on our launch, and also now when I get so many laws, then I go want for make you of viewers go want for know much about them laws then they, because since when I don't launch this new policies, yeah, so now we be supposed to go through mm -hmm. the, the uh, driving school before a uh, acquire license. Now we want viewers go want for no waiting as some of them laws there yeah, so if we want to put some back inside those new policies. No policy the law the law na parliament the one. But parliament also give it power for develop policy system for enhance we operations. And one of the policies who don't come up with First timers of driver's license, they for go through parliament, eh, sorry, driving schools. Parliament give you power for issue driver's license or issue vehicle license for enforce on vehicles and we not in compliance. For enforce on drivers then. We get the power for tour, we get the power for plan. Possibly they drive in a manner we not correct, for example, you know, fix seat belt, no offense, no law, and the parliament give you that law for enforcer. If they smoke cigarettes or smoke anything, if they drive now offense. If they drink water, not to just run, if they drive now offense. So whatever they do, that distraction on the road, now offense. If they talk on the phone, they drive now offense. So that in a law, we parliament give them an act and then debate and then pass it into law and say we now enforce them. This now then give regulatory powers. So based on the conduct of the road users, we come up with policies and regulations. So now one panda and you don't come up with the policy that all first timers they forget and, and driving school certificates before we allow them for their driver's license. So then first timers they are so we no ever know about the the, the laws. After we then come, where they don't come up through the driving schools, we then come, una can get any book where una can give them or where they will learn all the things. We they have which means the good training school and go learn. We don't learn. If you pass, you qualify for get license. Not to anybody we apply for license for get them. License not to like ID card or passport. So in a citizen we apply for get them. Now we fulfill the requirements then. We then state you get the knowledge on the language of the road. You get the knowledge on the basic laws then, the road signs and markings. If you not savvy, then they give license. Now you don't get no side of a complaint. Because criteria they wouldn't set. If you not fulfill and you don't go get them. So Una can monitor them driving schools and they for CC then they really teach the beginners them then would signs and also the laws we, them. We don't engage them, we don't give them the manual, we don't inspect them. 
Then when they are free to run inspection facilities, we know say they are satisfactory for them begin to operate. We go improve as we go along. So, um, viewers go once for no waiting at the penalty in case um, a driver go against the laws there. So, especially the public drivers there. Who's law? Then laws there, so like, you know, for drink, where you they drive, you know, for smoke, and even, you know, for play loud music and all that thing there. Well, the maximum under the road traffic regulation for them law is 400,000. You know, you see the belt, now 400,000 maximum. Depending on your conduct, now you will make the, 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 the policeman or the warden sorry for you, he write for you, maybe 200,000. But if you challenge them, you will give 400 maximum, you know, get mercy for you. The same thing if you drink water, if you wear a bag in the drive, all that in our offense. They smoke cigarettes in the drive, now offense, smoke tire, fire extinguisher, triangular reflector, only that the people will pull a spear tire if you don't get an all in one in our offense under the road traffic acts and regulation. So now, where you they talk about the offense, and I go want for no like of you as go want for no if he owner don't ever get cases them like I'm um, away driver go the drive with a bag and I don't ever make an arrest for them thing then they. Then cases they them boku te them boku. Then call a reckless driving. Then a reckless driving. Now you, you because we drive with them loose ah uh, sus. Slippers. So take with the drive, the the, 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 the slippers come on your foot. Now problem is younger, so you know when you must break. So now we prefer you to drive with ten to, and you, you drive with the slippers. So the offense and they will hold them back. That is zero. That we can see woman and that is zero. Now that operation and they hold the slippers, phone, in the top and regulate phone. In the regulate phone, whether you need call, you send text message. All that in our offense. You smoke cigarettes. So man, they see me in a motor car. I smoke. Na me on motor car. Na me one day day. All that in our offense. Whether na you one day day, you get passengers. All now. You know for nothing we drive. That's what he lost. Once he drive, he forgot the taste for he driving. If you want smoke pa, you vehicle, you smoke your cigarettes, you move. You drink your water, you move. You eat, you move. But you eat, you they drive. Now offense. So all that are four four hundred thousand, some are two hundred thousand. So as you say, plenty of cases then they will don't come up concerning them um, violation of the laws then they so what else I say can do with the money? We get what you call single treasury account. Any money they go. You pay into the government of Sierra Leone account. Now, part of the road tax. You see government do road maintenance. There is a whole agency responsible for road maintenance fund. We they generate revenue, road maintenance for the keeper and the treasury. SLRE they use them for maintenance road, for rehabilitate roads, for construct roads. So that's what the road sector is. So now part of the road maintenance fund, that money will generate. So. Now, um, since the 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 um, road safety authority cops taking them not it and we can see them most of the time and then are starting um, um, stations then but at the same time especially at the eastern part we can see most of the time especially then containers them we can see people can see map up the containers them so what's in the the road safety they do about that is it the containers them then trailer then containers them we can even see people can team up that ain't no, 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 that ain't an offense. That ain't an offense. Container, na for cargo. If you go load post in day, na offense. In fact, that they will not to na police. Then they hold the driver and they charge and go court. We can really see boku driver and they parin by road. Na one of the reasons that ain't day. When they hold her, you know, would issue ticket to somebody with the plan to go kill people there. So therefore, they hand that over to police. Police and they charge them go out. That's a serious of you know, it's different from seat belt, mobile phone, drink driving. You know, if I drink driving, you know, get a um, breathalyzer as well. When they check you, you know, see the alcohol content that the system will impair your driving, your ability for drive. We hand you over to police for prosecution. We get a lot of breathalyzer and we just prepare ourselves 
December 1, we were in our streets of the DM for three hours. Till go, you three to the third of January, because we said the festive period. And the so now that brings me to the question of some vehicles, then, especially then Selena um, vehicle there. So, how much you came? You came um, um, licensing for? Like how much passengers they supposed to take? Because we can see the way out in the cluster, people then inside the vehicle, they will talk. You say, oh, now go and sell it because now they the license with. So, how much you can license and sell in a motor car there? No, if you, if you overload, for example, the Serena, I think it will take 12 passengers. If you go take three, three, including the front, if you go take 16 passengers, now offense, and you now excess passengers. So then we will then we get a ticket. Now the reason you like you see them, they give people ticket to a driver or a particular motor. You can see them put up and the orange season and they then you get 20, 30 tickets, 40 tickets during the course of the year. Because under the road traffic, road transport authority amendment act. Uh, some tickets and they then call it a flying ticket. They issue and to a vehicle because when they get over, when they break and you know they break. So the driver he then issue a ticket. When they call a flying ticket, they go input them. In fact, now they try to develop a system by the end of the month. Any vehicle owner and phone number for it. So if they issue ticket to you, you get an alert. So they don't issue the ticket to for social offense. So when they come for that, you know now see tickets. Say. But for now, you know the go now the finance you put up get twenty tickets. And but you pay because of this recklessness on the road. You go overload, then go police will warn you for stop, you know they stop. You they move. And then if you ticket, we they can't for renew the license, they don't renew until you pay the tickets. So how many years the license they can take for the vehicles? Especially no, like the Puda Puda. No, annually, every year. And most of the time, we can see the Poda Poda, them, some of them can use that iron seat. Some Poda Poda not even good inside for make um person go even see them. And that can be bad. Accidents can happen. You can see so many injuries. So what in SLRS say they do towards them to them uh, vehicle and they? The issue of uh, iron seats and then Poda Poda, of course, we don't try and don't they reduce. Because we've been, first we do survey, we pronounce a ban. So, but who go try for the improve them, the seats? You still get some more problem. But for totally eliminate them, the strategy now is government they bring them in transport system. And it's trying to set up cooperative through one project called IRON, Integrated Resilient Urban Mobility Project. IRON, that's what they call it. A World Bank funded. And it comes a large number of buses. We go apply. From Godridge mm -hmm. to Waterloo. Mm -hmm. And I the call you the one in the dedicated lane. Where in fact the comfort will go in at that transport day, you will get motor car, you will prefer an elephant house. So we can get less traffic on the road. Yes, the projects they go on. If I mean they then they build all the more and park in a long lane. I mean they build, then they relocate that market in a long lane, on the other side, all the parts of that project. Here. Then they improve the corridor there. I mean, they see for the time for relocate the Abacha women because of that corridor day, the bus is then get for the pass. So that no traffic morning, you will know that the bus. Every few minutes, you see bus they pass. So that people then go park their motor car, they don't go spend better money than fear the game. Way off back, just the load, you go to use. Pass them on a weekend, now you go to use your motor car. Okay. Um, as the program began to an end for today, I go want to make you know, or whose word you go want for left for viewers them. Well, we they talk. Let us talk about road safety. You see, when we talk about road safety, now everybody in business, journalists, civil society, imam, pastor, everybody, for join road safety or promote road safety. If you didn't say what you talk, talk about road safety. Advice driver. The new driving license will come with and for promote road safety. And we try now for bring more technology than road safety so that uh, we go get rid of certain things that already happen at the road. Cameras and get for candy, we'll put the control room. So if bad things happen at you, they get the direct to in our offices here. So, so we'll get street slides? Yes, that's all that part of the project here with the the this urban project I tell you about. So a lot of things in there for they happen 
by towards the first second quarter of uh, 2022. A lot of improvement here for you on the road between Godrich to Atalu and the Corridor Eleven. Okay, thank you very much. We you join we inside the studio. That's now the public relations manager for the Sierra Leone Road Safety Authority, Wena Abdul Karim Dumbuya. As in the world we left we with today, say they say road safety now everybody in business. If any source you do, you get for the talk about road safety and not see the driver, the drive bad. You say, Lale fam, you need for caution the driver because you save your life involved. And that's what this program will come to one end for today. And me wake out this program to one today. Me your name na Isa to smile to say. Until we meet again to another edition of the program Salon Morning Discoveries. I say, ta-ta. Mm -hmm.